was 10 in the morning when students and staff members walked out of McCaskey High School. They're protesting the school board's decision to hire a superintendent from Seattle and not in-house candidate Mark Prezar. They left class on a blustery Friday morning to make their voices heard. We feel like he genuinely cares. McCaskey students, teachers and administrators demonstrated on the front lawn against the school board's decision to bypass interim superintendent Matt Prezoir for the permanent job. Because of his 18 plus years in the school district that once he steps up to position of superintendent, he won't leave within like the next four years or so. I think Matt has brought a relationship that we've needed and he's brought some healing after COVID and he's got some great ideas. The board selected Ricardo Rocky Torres, an assistant superintendent in the Seattle School District. He has a strong educational background. Prezoir, the chief financial officer, won't get his superintendent certificate and master's degree until May. My only problem is the man doesn't have a master's degree, okay? He'll and, have it in May. Okay, well, when he gets it, apply. There are great individuals in this world, and they're not always the most qualified people on paper but you don't find them often, and I feel like Matt is definitely one of those people. The board conducted interviews, held meetings with the candidates, and took a survey of the school community. Just released results show the vast majority strongly favored Prozwara. We made the decision that we made based off of all the different data points that we had, and we did so in, as, a, as a unified body. It feels very anti-democratic to us that the school board chose the candidate who is not supported by the overwhelming majority of the community. The board is expected to finalize its decision with a vote at its March 7th meeting. Live in Lancaster, Barbara Barr, WGAL News 8.